the most candy wins even more candy? Not just any candy, an entire mountain made of candy. Huh. Big rock candy. First, you climb it. Then, you eat it. Then, you camp on it. Then, you eat it again before you kayak. If you keep describing it, you won't have any time to win it. Ready, set, <laughs> yeah, but how does this thing work? Oh, 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 go! We gotta hurry! Wait, where's your costume? I'm going as a dog. That's funny. Listen, until Trick or Treat becomes Trick or Doggy Treat, I'm not interested. Besides, you're not gonna get much candy wearing that. Uh, what? I'm a knight! Your costume's terrible. Relax, as long as I'm wearing something, I'll get candy. What are they gonna say? No candy for you! Your costume's terrible. But it's Halloween. In my day, we earned our candy with clever costumes. This is all you get. An onion. And only because it's stale. That's the lamest costume ever. Hey, now that's a costume. Oh, hey, sissy. <laughs> Trick or treat. Oh, what a beautiful costume. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> that's right. This awesome costume has already earned me three bags of candy. <laughs> I got a birthmark that's more clever than that costume. I'm a knight in shining armor. Yeah, good luck with that, Tess. <laughs> Are we going where I think we're going? Yeah, I thought so. Please, how could you deny a sweet young boy a costume on Halloween? Well, I guess we could let them try the suit of a thousand faces. It's only a prototype. Untested, unpredictable, possibly dangerous, and almost certainly unsafe. So, it's perfect for Johnny. Exactly. The suit uses electro-hologram technology, <laughs> which produces a lifelike simulation, making the wearer appear completely different. So you mean I can look like anything I want? Well, sort of. All you have to do is push the button on your chest. A jellyfish. Really? <laughs> Let me try that again. <laughs> a bigger jellyfish. <laughs> Great. It's a prototype, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Blast off! Let's pillage some candy! <laughs> Aren't you a little old for trick or treating? Give me your candy or be destroyed! No, please. I really, really, really want that big rock candy mountain. You are making me sad. That's your costume? I'm a marooned alien raising a sullen teenage girl. They can't afford silly costumes. But you don't eat candy. I don't eat meat. I love candy. And soon the Big Rock Candy Mountain shall be mine. It's showtime, dog. Now that's a costume. What is that? I'm a prototype. Hey, Dookie, I'll bet with this costume changing thing, we can hit the same house multiple times. Right, 
suit. Don't leave me hanging. <laughs> Get it? Strengths. Hanging. <laughs> <laughs> Just give me the candy. This costume changer thingy is awesome. I'm gonna totally win Big Rock Candy Mountain easy. Guess again, Tess. Uh, say what? <laughs> oh, winds away and this candy's heavy and I'm running out of fuel. Candy storage, store your candy here. Free candy storage. Perfect. <laughs> children with your silly old customs. Have your fun, but rest assured that Big Rock Candy Mountain will be mine. Get real, Eugene. You got no costume, no candy, and no chance. As my dear mama says, never do anything that you can get someone else to do for you. Yeah, well, I don't see your servants trick-or-treating for you. There's no way you can win. Okay, you twisted my arm. I will now reveal my master plan. <laughs> Thank you for all your candy collecting. I'll take it from here. <laughs> Didn't see that coming. You see, Johnny, it's trick or treat, and I chose trick. <laughs> so as we say in the candy business, so long, suckers. <laughs> Something tells me we're not calling it a night. No, we're getting our candy back. The queen is not amused. It's go time. Never separate a vegan from his candy. Never. <laughs> Well, let's see what I get. Well, at least I got a bell. <laughs> let's roll! Stop, or else. Well, I can see everything from up here. Great. I don't get boot fuel. Figures. Guests, sorry you can't stay for dinner. Sissy, grab my hand. Now let's slow this rig down. Am I not surprised? Look out! <laughs> I think that's the last of them. <laughs> huh? Thanks for saving me. That would have really... <laughs> well, at least I still have toast. <sighs> so this is what the trick part of Trick or Treat is like. Wait, that's it! Well, well, bling bling. It looks like you've had a very busy night of trick or treating. Oh, I'm positively exhausted. Now, can we get this thing moving? Just announce that I'm the winner and hand over the Big Rock Candy Mountain edible playset. Clearly, the winner of this year's Halloween Hullabaloo is. Eugene! Mama! Oh, what a pleasant surprise! Uh, hey, where'd you get the lizard? That's not important! Did you steal that candy? Oh, steal is such a strong... Ow! Ow! Oh, oh, yes, okay! You tell the mayor that this candy belongs to Johnny Test and that he should be declared the winner! Is what your mother saying true? Oh, well, now... Ow! Yes, okay! I took the candy! As punishment, I want you to rub your belly and hop on one leg! and do a hundred push-ups. Push-ups? Oh, but mother, I... Oh, now, there'll be plenty
plenty of time for belly rubbing and uh, push-ups later. Right now, we have a winner to announce. If this candy belongs to Johnny Test, then I have no choice but to declare him the winner. Congratulations, Johnny! Johnny? Oh, wait! Uh, that's me! <gasps> ha! Tricked you right back! And now for my candy. Hold it, Test! A huge heap of that candy is mine! And perhaps you forgot all my candy in there. <laughs> Actually, Mr. Mayor, that candy belongs to all of us. We're all winners. Except Bling Bling. Oh, well, then I declare everyone but Bling Bling the winner! Happy Halloween! So, winning candy in a candy collecting contest is all right by me. Backyard Candy Mountain is so sweet. Happy Halloween, everyone! So, what'd you do this time? Write your name in the yard with a lawnmower? Uh, yeah. But this is way worse. Don't you know what today is? No, but I do know the door is not going to answer itself. All right! Smook City, here we come! I think that Pomeranian down at the store was big in my dookie vibe. <laughs> Ooh, Valentine's Day is the grossest, sickest, barfiest holiday ever invented! It's not as gross as March 9th. Are you kidding? This is way worse than National Booger Eating Day. Girls are trying to kiss me! How awful. Nobody's putting their lips on me. This year, I don't even want to hear a smooch. <laughs> Yuck! Mwah, 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 mwah. See? This is what I'm talking about. It's the most disgusting thing in the universe. Mwah. No, that's the most disgusting thing in the universe. My parents are zombies? Sweet. Not sweet! They want to eat our brains! Hey, at least it ain't kissing. No eat brains. Only one kisses. Kisses. Yeah! Yeah! Susan, Mary, Mom and Dad got turned into zombies. Yeah, but they don't want to eat our brains. They want kisses instead. You two seem to know an awful lot about this. <laughs> Just because we know about it doesn't mean we totally caused it by accident and have no idea how to stop it. Right, Mary? Right. You guys are so busted. Day. So, we synthesized a pheromone to repress moral activity in the amygdala while simultaneously boosting oxytocin levels throughout the brain. Ah, got it. Yeah, he don't got it. We made a love potion so Kill would want to kiss us. <sighs> but it kind of, sort of, um, mutated into a deadly zombie virus that spreads by kissing. <laughs> Best be ready. Nobody's kissing me or you today, Dookie. It's time to call in the big guns. You have reached Area 51.1. We cannot take your call right now because we are busy with super secret crises. We should do this more often. <laughs> Plan B. Can't you two, like, make some kind of thingy to make the kissy zombies go bye-bye? You mean an antidote? No, I mean a thing that... Yeah, he means antidote. We could, but the only known antidote is made with a rare chemical called Ritosaban. And the only supply of Ritosaban is found at the Institute. And the Institute's all the way across a zombie-infested town. We'd never survive. Even with the help of our newest invention, the Haymaker. <laughs> Sweet! <laughs> to a world where everyone's a zombie. And worse, every day is Valentine's Day. We're gonna get to that stupid lab and make that, that... Antidote. Antidote! It's not gonna be easy, but with your brains and my awesomeness, we are going to save the world! Stay close, and remember, 
No matter what happens, do not get kissed under any circumstances. Unless it's Gil. Are you crazy? You become a zombie. He's right. No getting kissed. Unless it's zombie Gil. Yeah, I can hear you. Oh, it's okay, little girl. You'll be safe with us. Tiny zombie girls are no match for this. Kisses. How about a tall glass of punch? <laughs> it may have a few bugs. Run! There's someone on the school roof. Shuffling walk, dead eyes. A brain barely functioning? Sounds like a zombie! Nope, it's just Bumper. Oh, well in that case, we've gotta help him! No way! Come on, Bumper's tough! Maybe he can help us! Please, no! I don't wanna be a zombie! Please! <laughs> oh yeah, he'll be a big help. Come on, Bumper! We gotta get out of here! That's what I'm trying to do! I built a rocket! so I could blast out of this no-good zombie town. Right. Well, at least you've got a plan. Ah! First there's zombies everywhere, and now your dog is talking, Test! Could this day get any freakier? Ah! They blocked the only way out! Well, I guess we're finished. Don't give up! I got an idea. But you may not like it. Say well. Covering your cheek? No reason. Let's go. Bumper, catch! <laughs> ha! Lipstick! It's nothing! I'm fine! Somebody kissed you on the roof! Oh, this is bad. No, no, no! No! I'll be okay! I promise! Well, I guess if you promise. <laughs> Come, Susan! Be safe with me in this totally dark, cramped closet! Ew! No! Oh, suit yourself. <laughs> I'm sorry, my love. You're on your own. I'm just too important to risk my life. Phew! Safe at last. <laughs> oh, the delicious irony. <laughs> Look out! <laughs> it's gotta be here somewhere. <gasps> there it is! Protosa Man! This antidote is highly potent, and with the right dose, it should reverse the zombifying effects of our love potion. Mm. It's ready! <laughs> Zombie kill! <sighs> I know we're a team, but you have to save the world on your own! You can do it! We believe in you! Susan, Mary, I strongly advise you not to kiss the zombie! <laughs> Yes. <laughs> Wait, stop! Are we crazy? We need pictures so we'll always remember this magical moment. You can't do this. How are we? <laughs> it was worth it. Wait a minute. How are we supposed to get this antidote to the whole town? Forget it, Johnny. We're finished. Everyone else is a zombie and we're next. Well, we had a good run, though, didn't we? We sure did, kid. We sure did. 
You know, I always thought I'd die in a pit of quicksand. Or strapped to the back of a rocket. <gasps> That's it! <laughs> They're everywhere! Nothing wrong! No, oh, I don't know what's worse, the zombies or that thing! Yeah, but if I aim it at you... <laughs> A nice use of reverse psychology on an inanimate object. Now to end this zombie apocalypse. <laughs> hurry, Johnny! They're coming back to life! Or death! Or hurry! <laughs> Ooh, my last kiss is a living dog. Huh? And I'm all out of breath freshener! Johnny, do something! Not being zombies! <laughs> What'd I tell you, Dookie? We're heroes! And better yet, I didn't get a single kiss! <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day, Johnny! <laughs>